Man, why has it got to rain when I'm trying to record this? Yo, my name is Pestily, and without further ado, let's crack straight into it. So, this is arguably one of the shittest spawns for this run. So, we can just show you most spawns. So, if you spawn here, you can go check Concordia. You can go check Concordia. You can go check Concordia. Should we come in here? Yeah, we might as well. We'll show you the spawns. So you come here. I don't believe it's actually this one. I'm pretty sure I'm in the wrong place. Yep. So we'll come here. So, in these runs, okay, I don't think it's this one either. So, in these runs, right, you're going to be making absolute bank. Yep. And here is the door. You get some rare spawns. bad boy and the money you'll be making from these is like easily 400k to a mil to two mil the money is nuts you can do these as a scav as a pmc they're insanely just free especially in these rooms, but you check anyway. And then you unlock this with your key. Now just to clarify, those keys are Concord 64 and Concord Office, which is Concord Office and Concord 64. Check in here for rest pawns on the floor. See, we got an egg. I'm going to check over here. Nothing special. And a battery. Come in here. Check all this. Check the PC. Check here. Nice little teddy. Check there. And we're good. Now this room obviously isn't isn't a room that you would always run to, you would only run to here if you're extracting down there or if you spawn over here. Otherwise, I would just run, even even coming here, I would just run across and ignore it. But we have shown you the loot spots for it if you decide to check that spot on your runs, because you can. I ain't stopping you. But if you want it to be safe, running straight to those rooms is probably your best bet. As you'll see from this, the money you make is nuts. So I'm just going to do these for extra running. And let's go. You obviously want to pop SJ6s and trimmer dolls only if you want to do it fast. Look at my stam, it just is going up. I'm not losing anything. I can jump, it'll come back. Check here, there's always people. Spawn, 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 spawn. Spawn down there. Rest spawn here or here. They will be hiding in the ground. You can check the body. Rare spawns there. Down there you can get some too. 
Get a bunch of tools. Random stuff here. Tech spawn, tech spawn, tech spawn, tech spawn, and tech spawn. Loot those if you like. There's always an item hidden here. You don't see it, but it's there. Tech spawns, rare spawns. They can hide in this, the uh, box, like on Lighthouse, so be careful. Spawns here and on here, but uh, you rarely see them. GPUs, GPU, random bullet and med spawns. Rare spawn, rare spawn, med spawn. Sometimes med, med spawn back here. Tech spawn, tech spawn, and tech spawn in the box. Sometimes med spawn there. Now we run down here, you'll see defuels occasionally here, all here. You can get some nice stims in all these spots that I just zoomed. More tools. I don't check here, but you can get rare tool set, and I ignore that. And I ignore that. Like, the money you're getting from these runs is... You don't need to be checking toolboxes. There, 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 and on the floor. Check this box. Respawn in this box. You can get meds all over here, defuels. More drinks. You can't break this anymore. You gotta go through the top, so we come here. <coughs> Excuse my cough. We check this for defuels, respawns, and boom. You get your iron gate key. All of these doors, and you want to unlock them all. Anyone who tells you not to unlock these all is just trying to get free loot for themselves because you're just going to miss out. So there. Here. Especially hidden. In this, on here, and right there. bad boy and you get two check in this you check here you check the bodies and you check back here for a rest one check this bed two and you get it here. sometimes I'll check all this Check here for your bullet spawns, your defuels. your tech spawns. And then if you're a lucky fella and you manage to snipe check 15 on the market, which, good for you, congrats brother, you've got the check 15 key. Now this key, right, gives you good goods. Sometimes they oh, well, not sometimes, a lot of the times spawns here, a lot of the time spawn in here, on the chair, on this bad boy, on this chair, on the floor right there, there, like, or all over the whole thing, in here, sometimes on the floor, on the floor here, on the chair here, all here, see? A little hidden, be careful. More on the chair, oh, there's more on the chair, see? And then floor, right there and right here. And then we head to this, unlock this bad boy. And I've heard there is a spawn over here, but I wouldn't trust it because I haven't seen it ever. But apparently, somewhere here there's a rare spawn. I've never seen it, but you do you. 
And door open. And now we run down here. There's a lot of scavs and PMCs that sometimes will hide in here. You can go up there if you want to loot the spawns, like with the key, but I personally would ignore that room. It's not the greatest, in my opinion. It almost never has anything in it. So you come in this bad boy. Uh, you can loot those. Check here. Check here. Check your PC. Check your body. Check there and there for just random spawns. Check there. Right now, I don't believe you can see anything, but if you walk up to here, you'll see the items. Check here for sugar, keck tapes, all on these. Rare, uh, not rare, but med spawns. Intel spawn in here. Personally, I've had the Intel spawn in here like 15 times, and I've never seen it spawn up on the seat in the mark room. Well, I, that's a lie. I've seen it once or twice. Streamer items here. Med spawns on these. Random streamer med spawns. PC. 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 Med spawns and shit and food and sugars. Run straight this way. Going here, check here, check on the table, and check here for your rare spawns. As you can see, we got two this time. Check your PC, check those if you like. Med spawns. And before we go into marked upstairs, I, I like to check here because you get defuels and other good rare ammos and shit. Like, see, SPP we see up there. I always grab this shit, but. When am I ever going to run it? We don't ever know. You check all there, and then even up there. You get med spawns and defuels and whatnot. <laughs> we go up here. GPUs. I've had one spawn right there. Tetrises have spawned in that, so be very careful. You'll have to crouch and check. Check your body. Rare spawns, sugars. Rare spawns, sugars. Check your duffel. You got all your toolbox stuff. You got more toolbox stuff in there. And then when it lets me over, ammo, med spawn as you can see, yoink. All these spots while they have food can have sugar and meds. Check there. Check there. You check your floors. Cat, and they always hide in the ground, so be careful. You got your meds, milks, and sugars. I hope my audio is working, and I hope this video hasn't cut out in the fucking, you know, trying to record it. But yeah, you would run these all the fucking time, whether it's as a PMC or as a scav. Your defuels and morphines all on there. Your intel spawn. Two spawns and a moonshine. I don't check over there. I ignore it. Check for keys. Check for food and sugars. Tech spawn. Tools. Tech spawn, tech spawn, tech spawn, tech spawn. Personally, I only loot up here if no one's running to me. I'll loot those. Tech. You loot this bad boy. You loot the PC. You can loot this and check the floor for a tech spawn, but I ignore it. More meds. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba -ba. In there. And there. And then you head down. And now we head to the final room as a scav. Pretty much. This run is how a lot of scav runs for you are going to go. You'll spawn near construction, you'll run to that first building, you'll run to here, and then you'll come out of here. 
you'll come into there, which we're about to show you, and then you'll loop through sewer. And that'll be pretty much your go-to run as a scav on this map every time. Check in there, on the side here, your duffel, your dead scav, random good spawns, more toolbox stuff, all on these. Check those if you're feeling frisky. You go in here, check there, check the plate on the desk, and you check here. And then when you're done with that as a scav, you just literally jump here, and boom. Like you literally can just stand here and it'll extract you. And as a PMC, we will either pretty much head to here, which as a PMC, you might not get this spot, which we haven't either, but boom, you'll extract through that. The next, or the other good extract, which is just as good, if not better, is underpass, and we'll take you to that now quickly. But these are the two extracts you usually get if you spawn away from uh, these buildings. But if you spawn here, the only one you're going to have is kill mob. And I would recommend bringing a green flare. So we go in here. And all you would do is just jump. I'm gonna get oh, shot probably. That's bad. We're gonna... Never mind, we didn't. And you just come down here. And boom! There goes the dynamite. That's your game, and you've just made two mil from a run. So that's all you need to know from the run, just those three places, four if you decide to go to Concordia. But apart from that, good luck, have fun, and I'll see you at the battlefield, mate.